Hey y'all, how's it going? It is me, Alexis Celine. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. So for today's video, I created this look here, perfect for the New Year's Eve party. If you're interested in seeing how I created this look, then just keep watching. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you haven't yet, and hit the bell so you'll be notified of any future uploads of mine. So without further ado, let's get to this video. Right, so I already went ahead and prepped my skin and did my eyebrows off camera to save a little time. And I'm gonna go ahead and prep my eyes. And of course, the primer I'm gonna be using is the ABH eye primer. And I'm just gonna grab a brush. This is the Bill Techniques crease brush to blend that and buff it into my eyelid. And just so this video is not 30 minutes long, I'm just gonna do one eye on camera and do the other one off. Come back and finish the rest of my face. Now once I have that blended out with the brush, I'm gonna take a, a little beauty sponge and buff it in and really press it in to make sure the product is not gonna be leaving all over. It is set. I'm gonna start off with the Morphe X Simply Star Palette. I'm gonna start off with the black shade and that is Fast Lane. And I'm gonna kind of carve out wing liner that connects to my crease. So yeah, it's gonna be very tedious. I'm gonna try to take my time so I don't mess this up because it's gonna be the outline for the eyelid. Take that color Fast Lane and I'm gonna put a little bit on my brush. I'm just trying to focus on the outline and make sure that I have the shape that I want. I'm gonna take a smaller brush and blend it out a bit and then just kind of gradually build it up. Take a little bit on this brush. And above that, I'm gonna add the shade Vroom Vroom, which is a matte gray shade, and lightly start blending that with the black shadow. okay if it looks a little bit messy because you can go back in there with the black shade and really define and deepen the crease. I'm just going to blend that out with another brush. Now I'm gonna go back and pick up the little liner brush with the black shade and define. Now I'm just going to blend this out a bit. This is a small shader brush and add in some more black and some gray. I'm going to mix the two. Since this look is for New Year's, I'm going to be going all out and I'm going to, of course, add glitter. This doesn't have to be precise and crisp and clean because I am going to be adding glitter on top of it. 
but yeah, I just want to make sure that it's defined and darkened. You know, it has some definition to it. All right, so now that I have that, I'm go ahead and carve it out with a thin little brush. These are from Amazon, I believe they are paint brushes. So I'm gonna go back with the eye primer and carve it out. And I'm gonna be bringing it all the way over here. Like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect because you can always go back in there and add product. Go back into the palette and pick up this shade right here, which is Custom Rims. And that's going to go all over my lid. All right, so I'm going to take a M124 brush. I'm going to be using different brushes, but most of them that I'm going to be using are Morphe brushes. Go ahead and spray it with some primer water from Wet n Wild. This is a really pretty color. And I'm gonna go ahead and pack it on my finger as well. So I'm also gonna be adding a loose glitter, this silver one here. What I like to do is I just like to dump a little bit into the lid. So I'm gonna spray this little brush. This is the 213 brush. I'm gonna try a little experiment and use some Elmer's Elf Glue to use it as a base for the glitter so it's not like falling all off and it sticks. So here I'm just adding the glue. Gotta improvise, right? <laughs> And with my finger, I'm gonna go ahead and go back and define the crease a little bit more. So I'm just picking up the gray color. And I'm gonna add some of the black as well. Go ahead and add some mascara. And I'm gonna use the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. I went ahead and did the other eye off camera. And I'm back and I'm gonna go ahead and add some more primer to my face because I did use a makeup wipe and some micellar water to remove the fallout. I just wanna make sure that my skin is nice and moisturized before I add my foundation. So I'm gonna go back and add the primers and I use the Essence Hydrating Skin Primer. And then I also use the Milani Bright Side Illuminating Primer. Please excuse my face, it is red now since I've been rubbing it. I have rosacea so it is normally red but it's not this noticeable so yeah, don't mind that. with the Milani. For foundation, I'm gonna be using the L'Oreal Infallible. This is the Pro Glow. Since my skin is dry, I like to use this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and add another layer because as you can see, my face is still red. I'm gonna move on to concealing my face and I'm gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Ivory. Then I'm gonna go in and use the e.l.f. 6 Hour Camel Concealer in the shade Light Peach. And 
And before I move on to the next, I'm gonna go ahead and set it with my Maybelline Fit Me a loose setting powder. Now I'm gonna go ahead and fill it with this eye. I'm gonna go ahead and set this one as well. All right, so now that I have everything down on my base, I'm gonna go ahead and pop on the lashes. For lashes, I am gonna be using some from Amazon. It's this brand right here. I'm gonna be using Duo Lash Glue to apply to the lashes and also to my eyelid. So for highlight, I'm gonna use this Kali Cosmetics, these two shapes here. I'm gonna go ahead and spray my brush. A no highlight is always a must for me. For bronze, I'm going to use this one from Milani in the shade Sunkissed. And then I'm gonna go over it with my Butter Bronzer from Physicians Formula, my fave. Okay, so for under eye, I'm just gonna run the gray and black under. And I'm gonna add the black just to the very end. And I'm going to go ahead and pop some mascara onto those lashes. Alright, so for lips, we're going to stick to Nude Vibes. Just because the eyes are really bold, I want something more subtle. So for lips, I'm going to do the LA Colors Chocolate Lip Liner and the Wet n Wild Nudie Patootie. This is the Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit. I'll go ahead and line my lips. So then I'm going to top it with this liquid lip gloss. Alright, so now that I have everything on, I'm going to go ahead and finish off with setting my face. The setting mist from earlier. Alright y'all, so that is the completed look. I hope you enjoyed it. I really love how this came out. So sparkly, extra, and at perfect for the new year's party if you enjoyed it please don't forget to give it a thumbs up also if you aren't yet subscribed please go ahead and do so i'd love to have you here don't forget to hit the bell so you're notified of any future uploads of mine thanks again for watching i hope you have a wonderful holiday and yeah see you in the next video till then bye